The following tutorial is brought to you by WholeLoops.com. It's production time. I'm Reed Stefan, realist puppet in the game. Are you ready to get your 808s knocking? Because today we're going to do a little bit of parallel processing, adding harmonics to our kick in 808 to help them cut through the mix a little bit better. And we're gonna be using two different harmonic sources and blending them together uh, with our clean signal. So the first thing I'm gonna do is create some return channels for our distortion. So we're just gonna create one and two. And the first plugin we are gonna load, and this is always my go-to distortion plugin, is the Decapitator by Sound Toys. Now this thing is a uh, distortion weapon because you have all these different, I guess you could call them flavors or styles of distortion. Uh, I, my favorite has always been E, but let's, uh, let's go ahead and start sending our kick. Actually, let's send our kick about minus 10. And then we're gonna send our 808 at full blast. So let's go down to our decapitator channel. It's a little bit loud. We're going to be turning it down minus 15. We want our distorted signal to be about 15 decibels less than our dry signal. So let's hear, hear what we got going on here. So this is where we get to really uh, start dialing in how much distortion we want. I want this to be a little bit aggressive. So I'm just going to hit that drive knob a little bit aggressively. Give a little punishing. Now this may sound stupid as we solo this channel, but sliding this in nice and quiet underneath your clean signal is gonna bring you right to where you're trying to go. I love just shaping my distortion like this. Take out a little of the high. Let's uh, let's hear it in the mix with the rest of our song now. Without it. So yeah, so it's definitely bringing out just a little bit. You'll find that when you solo it, you can actually afford to hit this a little harder than you think. I know it sounds ridiculous when you're soloing it and it just sounds like farts, but these farts will save your mix down. Are you a music producer looking for that perfect chord progression to start your next hit? Do you struggle with chords, piano, and music theory? Then we've got the product for you. Introducing Poppin Progressions 2, the sequel to our organic MIDI sample pack filled with over 50 loops organized by key and scale for your convenience. Just grab a Poppin Progression and drop it in your session. Poppin Progressions 2 is available now only at wholeloops.com. Great. Next thing we're going to do, similar uh, concept, different plugin. We're going to head over to UAD and get the Vertigo Mix Satellite right here. And uh, we're actually going to be distorting the mids only. And this is why this plugin is such a distortion weapon, because we're going to pick on the second harmonic and the third harmonic generators to uh, really just target the mids. So let's solo what's going on here in this Vertigo plugin. Actually, I gotta send my 808 to it or else we ain't gonna hear anything. All right, let's see. Boom. Yeah, we'll send the kick to it, send the 808 to it. Yep, perfect. So here we are inside UAD Vertigo Mix Satellite and we're just gonna start hitting the drives on these things too. Actually gonna put this in serial. Mm. Now this is again super loud. We're gonna turn this down minus 15. 
let's hear this in context. See, each one is kind of filling in a different gap. Sorry, my computer can't handle all the harmonics. Let's take it to the next level. And this is where your 808 really starts to open up. Right now, everything is shoved right down the center. There's a lot of competition for the center in this mix, not just this mix, but in any mix. Chances are the majority of your channels are right down the middle. And uh, these returns are a great way to start opening stuff up a little bit. So we're just gonna spread this out a little bit, five and minus five. Let's just undo that so you can hear the difference. You can hear so much clarity jump out of your whole song just by taking two different uh, channels out of the center. Let's see if we can uh, maybe bump it a little bit further. This is where you get to kind of see how hard you can push it and then back it off. Because eventually it is going to sound a little ridiculous. But uh, as you can see, the sub is just jumping out and right in your face, absolutely love it. Didn't even change much, just adding in these two layers, super quiet, minus 15, a little bit to the outside. These aren't the only two plugins you could do this with. The idea is just to find two different distortions and combine them. Decapitator by Sound, Bo by sound, by sound Boys, Decapitator by Sound Toys, and the Vertical Mix Satellite by UAD just so happen to be my go-tos, my favorites, uh, just the ones that I've been using the most lately. So enjoy these techniques. I hope these uh, stereo 808s bless your mix downs forever and ever. Thank you so much for subscribing and joining me on my glorious quest to 100,000 YouTube followers. Thank you so much. I'll see you guys next time with another tutorial.